office, your basement perhaps. Homeowners everywhere still drying out tonight, but at least one local city is trying to get ahead of the floodwaters. Fox 6's Tammy Hughes has more new at 6. It's like a horror movie for homeowners. Beautiful basements backed up with what could be sewer water. A customer explained to me that the water came through the floor drain. This kind of cleanup is happening all over our area, and it's not an easy fix. For now, we have to extract the carpet, lift it, remove the padding, place the carpet down, clean and sanitize the carpet. It'll cost this Whitefish Bay homeowner about $2,000. They haven't been flooded here in over two decades. The public works director in West Dallas says they too are seeing that more and more. We have got flooding in areas that we never thought or in a million years that we would have flooding here. So the city is trying to get to the root of it. Is it through the floor drains? This spring they sent out this questionnaire to about 3,500 residents. If the home has a sump pump, experienced flooding in the past. Who live in areas that have had persistent problems in the last three years. This problem is not going to go away. And if things continue to intensify, it's going to just get very worse. If that's true, that means it's unlikely another two decades will go by before Service Master has to visit a home like this again. With the amount of rain that we got, it's nothing that they could have done. It'll just continue to go until it recedes on its own. And it, of course, did finally recede. But there are some things homeowners can do. Put in a sump pump and make sure it drains a good distance away from your home. The downspouts from your gutter should also be about six feet away from your home. Don't clog your city's catch basins with leaves or grass. And also, don't use a lot of water in your home when you know that a big storm is coming. Reporting live in the newsroom, I'm Tammy Hughes. All you homeowners dealing.